for several years actually before that, I had had a tingling right in the back of my right shoulder blade. It always felt like I needed to kind of stretch it out. That's the only way I could get any relief from it. Vascular surgeons do uh, work on every part of the body that's uh, outside of the heart and outside of the skull. So I get to care for the carotid arteries in the neck, I get to operate in the chest, in the belly, in the legs. One of the opportunities to, that we have in this unique institution is that we have not only the expertise to treat the patients that are very complex with current available techniques and technologies, but the ability to have access to newer devices and newer techniques that may not be applied everywhere yet. Aneurysms, which is a weakening of the aorta that can rupture and cause death. Uh, basically, 15 years ago, we used to do 100% of the surgeries open surgical repair. Now, 80 to 90% of them are done through two small incisions. And rather than the patient being here in the hospital a week to two weeks, now they go home the next morning. My uh, interests have always been in vascular surgery and uh, I learned uh, one uh, special area of vascular surgery that's relatively uncommon when I was a fellow at San Francisco uh, and that was to deal with problems of the thoracic outlet. The vascular surgeon up here said I really think that maybe we need to talk to Dr. Thompson about this. He's a thoracic outlet syndrome specialist. I ended up I had a blood clot that went all the way from my my collarbone to my shoulder blade. Thoracic outlet syndrome is, is a, a unique condition uh, where the blood vessels or nerves are pinched in the base of the neck, up uh, near the uh, collarbone, right behind the collarbone, uh, in a deep part of the neck where these nerves or vessels pass. We have a large volume of patients. Uh, I think our practice is one of the, the busiest in the country for TOS. This is a, a great institution. Uh, it has uh, uh, great uh, facilities, great resources, uh, an unusual uh, and, and very positive uh, marriage with a medical school where you have uh, great scientists and, and people that can bridge the bench to the bedside. Vascular surgery is unique in that we do both all of the medical care for our patients as well as all of the interventions that are needed. This is really a relationship long term that we have with our patients after we meet them for the first time. We need to treat maybe the acute problem that they present with and we have to address. But at the same time, this is a long-term progressive disease and progressive problem they have. Uh, we continue to see them most of the time for the rest of their lives. So we end up really having a long-term relationship with many of our patients, something that most surgeons are not used to. To see that kind of patient and find that they have a condition that we think we can offer treatment for and then have successful outcomes is, is still really a thrill and one of the things that keeps us going. I definitely recommend Dr. Thompson and this hospital. Yes, it's been, they've been wonderful.